Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 10 of Gigi Harum. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. No. <laughs> they just look like a married couple. And just how <laughs> together making me No. Oh, that's pretty. Take pictures, everybody. <laughs> Can I try?
Come on. Yeah. It's okay. You're still sleeping downstairs, though. <laughs> oh. <gasps> yeah, because I'm like, how do you explain that to your parents? Like, oh. yeah, mom and dad, boyfriend's sleeping over. Like, girl, let me tell you this. It'd be a cold day in hell if I asked my mother, even at the age I am, if I had a boyfriend and he could sleep over. No way in hell would that happen. Oh. I mean, well, yeah. Oh, well, then you need to talk to Kirby. <laughs> right? Like, be happy for him. Aww. And you want to buy her something for her birthday? Like, Yeah, need that money, need that grind.
But she's not. So the parent trap? Freaky Friday? No, no. Isn't that... Whatever you get her, she'll love it. Oh, you mean that first kiss glow? <laughs> well, Is it bad that I want her to play a guy in the show now? <laughs>
you just look so good. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Girl, you can run on the boots. I'm ready to see that. <laughs> Whoever is in the bride dress, I love it. <laughs> Oh no. She's too into her character. Mm -hmm. it, no, 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 baby, he's talking about you, he's talking about you, he's talking about you, he's talking about you! to her. 
her character was the best and worst time because she gets into it right in the final moment when it is her turn to essentially run. She got too, way too deep in it, girl. <laughs> Their first kiss, like, with fireworks. Like, oh, that's so cute. Like, oh my god. And then, like, the fact is that he went out to go find her something for her birthday. How he he decided to be a door dasher slash Uber Eats person so he could get enough money for her. That's so sweet. Like, oh my god. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> But no, that was, like, super, super adorable. It reminds me of my, okay, so my first true boyfriend a couple of years ago, um, he, he got me two things that, even though we're not together anymore, I still cherish, um, he got me this cute little message in a bottle with some, like, fake roses and everything, and then he, um... He got me this necklace. I don't know where the necklace is. I think it's probably in my jewelry box. Um, and then at the time, I cannot believe I'm about to say this. I, um, I bought him a controller for an Xbox. Nice. Yeah. And I hate sweet. <laughs> very demure. Very demure. <laughs> but no, yeah, I, um, a couple of years ago, I gave, when we were still dating, I gave him a, I think it was an Xbox One controller. Yeah. So even now, every single time he uses it, he probably has to, like, think of me. <laughs> And any time if I wear the necklace or I see the bottle, which I see the bottle like every day because of where I have it stored. And I'm like, I'll think about him for like a moment or two, three or four or five. Um, but <laughs> then the moment's gone. I'm like, okay, whatever. I'm just like, ish. Um, and it was, it was still sweet at the time. Super duper sweet. Even now it's still super duper sweet. Um, Thank God he didn't buy me, like, um, what was the other thing? Well, he bought me the lot, like, Kingdom Hearts 3, and then I bought myself, like, coffees and stuff, because, like, duh, I wanted it for myself. Like, your girl, I bought, um, I think, I have, like, three copies of Kingdom Hearts 3. Three, two or three. I, I, I was nuts. I was nuts. But, uh, hello, I'm a, I'm a... <laughs> I'm a Square Enix fan. I'm a Kingdom Hearts girl. So I gotta have, like, copies of, like, everything. Whether it's physical or digital. Because, like, I bought me physical d copies. And I bought me, um, a digital copy. For extra things. Because, duh. I wish I could do that for hell. Even Lollipop Chainsaw. Because that release is coming out sometime, I think, next week. But, um, at the time when the physical... No, the limited edition copies were, so were coming out... People sold them bitches out, and I couldn't get one. And I was like, you know, it's okay. I'll buy the digital one. So probably we'll be playing that sometime next week when it comes out. Probably day one or day two. I'm not so like so sure because I'm only off Wednesday and Thursday next week. So who knows how that'll go? But no, this was so fucking cute and adorable and wholesome as fuck. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode 10 of GG Harem. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join Magic Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode 11. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.